All right, so if you have an air fryer at home, this is a must have. If you don't have an air fryer at home, this is also a must have because maybe you're trying to watch what you're eating. You're watching how much seasoning you're using, how much oil you're using. This is going to atomize, meaning make it light and airy, whatever you spray on your food. So a little bit of oil on your stir fry vegetables, maybe a little bit of, and my new thing is avocado oil. I have discovered avocado oil. It's a high heat oil. It sautés well. It goes on the grill nicely. Many times, like yesterday, I, I grilled a steak and I and I brushed it with a little um, avocado oil in my seasoning before I put it on the grill. You know that bad boy cooked right up. So this is what it's all about. But the Evo sprayer is awesome because it takes whatever oil or solution you put inside. As long as that oil doesn't turn back to a solid, like say melted butter, you can use it inside. I use it for soy sauce. Use it for balsamic vinegar, all those kinds of things. Every pull of this trigger is one quarter teaspoon. So whenever you pull the trigger, it primes and loads a little reservoir inside and will dispense only a quarter teaspoon with every pull of the trigger. Four pulls of the trigger is one teaspoon of whatever's inside. Now, here are the color choices I have for you. You may choose this in a set of two blue, a set of two yellow. A set of two red. Here's your set of two. I believe we're calling this um, charcoal. Thank you. Set of two green and set of two purple. You will get four pre printed throat labels that are reversible. They say things like sesame oil, canola oil, balsamic, peanut oil, what have you. And then there's also a little um, funnel that goes right on the top. You can either have this spray horizontally or vertically. So it really is a remarkable way to do your work. Now I'm looking for my measuring spoon. He's hiding from me. My measuring spoon somewhere that I can't see him. Okay, while we're looking for the measuring spoon, let's bring in Rick Roman, who is going to tell us more about the Evo sprayer. Mr. Roman, I apologize. I was going to do a little comparison. Oh, here it is from the Sangwood of Bitmy Department. Right. All right, I found that's it. Right, Dave. That's right, David. Well, first of all, you just said it. This is a patented trigger head, all right? So it's a very unassuming looking bottle, but that allows you to spray a quarter teaspoon at a time. And the way I love to demonstrate this is so many people, when they try to use oil in the kitchen, I'm going to come up close to the camera. They pour out of a bottle, right? So what happens? So watch this when I try to pour out of a bottle, David. It comes out in a heavy stream. So what does that mean? You get a lot of oil in a small area. So you wind up using excess amounts of oil. With Evo, I can now take a quarter teaspoon at a time and cover these entire part of my tray, use three quarters of a teaspoon. That's probably two tablespoons that I wasted. So I get better coverage, less calories from fat. And then also, guess what, David? I'm spending less money because all those expensive oils now, I'm using a fraction of what I normally would use. I mean, this bottle of oil right here costs over $20, but now I can use less oil so I stretch it. And it doesn't matter if it's vegetables. Like right here, David, I'll show you. Here's a quarter teaspoon. I, I, this is my favorite other example here. If you tried to spread a quarter teaspoon of oil over your food, check this out. This is a quarter teaspoon, right? I don't get very far. But when I have my Evo, watch what happens right next door. One quarter teaspoon, I get a nice, light, even coat. Three pulls, three quarters of a teaspoon, perfectly coated that cauliflower. So you're not pooling the oil. You're getting crisper, better results, but less calories and less money you're spending on the oil. Well, I found my uh, quarter teaspoon measure, and yeah. I filled it with some toasted sesame oil. And there's a quarter teaspoon. Yep. Well, I got one piece of zucchini covered, sort of. <laughs> there's one quarter teaspoon out of a out of a measure. Or I can grab my Evo sprayer, open this one up, and there. Okay. Let's see if we can get this going. Okay. <laughs> there is a quarter teaspoon spray. That's one quarter teaspoon. There's a half a teaspoon. There's three quarters. I didn't even use a whole teaspoon of spray and everything got covered. This is important. If you want to give your French fries a little spritz of some oil before you put them in the air fryer, it just helps them get a little crispier. That's going to be great. Nothing is swimming now in what you put this in. Now, if, I, if I'm cooking with a low sodium soy sauce, I'll use it in my Evo sprayer because it helps do a light coating so things are not swimming in all that sodium, right? Yeah, David, that's exactly true. I and mean, if you said it before at the top, if you have an air fryer, this is the perfect accessory. Imagine if you're trying to just get a little bit of oil on your French fries. 
You can never do that by pouring, but when you have Evo, that patented trigger head allows you to spray a quarter teaspoon at a time. So for all these fries, that's a light even coat, one teaspoon. Think about the amount of calories you save with the amount of oil. Now, announce it's not just your air fryer. David, you want to make the best ever garlic bread. Think about not, instead of using butter, take a nice oil that you love. And for this entire loaf, I just coated it. You could never spread oil like that out of a bottle. But look at this entire piece of bread. It has a nice, perfect, even coat. So it gives you the opportunity to get maximum flavor, maximum coverage with minimum oil, minimum calories. And you're saving money on not using all that oil. I mean, it's so simple and so easy. Maybe you've got a little balsamic and you've got oh, yeah. a salmon, a whole salmon that you're ready to pop into the oven or on the grill. Then I'm able to give this a quick spritz. There's only three quarters of a teaspoon of balsamic vinegar. Really beautiful. Oh, I just got a snoop full of that. That'll open you up. Um, yeah. Don't miss out on this because we are very, very busy with this item and it's always a popular choice. You may choose a set of two blue, set of two yellow, set of two red. Here's your purple, most limited in the purple. Here's green, and charcoal is most popular. You might want to pick up a couple of sets of these because, Rick, as I mentioned, I have discovered avocado oil and I cook with it a lot now. And so, oh, yeah. this is really great because avocado oil is a super high heat oil. It can take up to 500 degrees. So, I use it on the grill, I use it when I saute vegetables. Um, all that kind of thing. So it really is dynamic. So you might want to get a couple sets and fill it up with all the different things you're using on a regular basis. Yeah, David, I'll tell you what, it's salad. I used less than a teaspoon of oil and vinegar, but I coated this entire plate of salad. And the beauty of Evo is it spreads it out, right? So what does that mean? Instead of clumping the oil into, into small areas, you're spreading that out, the vinegar, the soy sauce. Here's a great example. I'm just going to take a nice white piece of plastic here. And look at that. That's a half a teaspoon. And I don't know if you could see it, it covers this whole plate. So whether you're doing vegetables like these potatoes here and you want to get just the right amount of oil, you're able to use so much less but get so much more flavor. And then you're saving the money and the calories from all that excess oil you normally would have used by pouring it out of a bottle. It's just a better way to use oil and vinegar in your kitchen. Well, it's a phenomenal way to take advantage of all the foods that you love to eat and when you're trying to be smarter about how you top them. Now, Rick, you're coming back with a four jar set of a chef's right. helper in the kitchen. I can't wait for everybody to see that. So stick around, okay? Excellent. I'll see you in a little bit, David. All right, pal. Let's check in with Mary because Jesus.